Hello, everyone. I hope you're enjoying Battle for Azeroth as much as I have been. I wanted to go ahead and get back into some gold making videos, uh, and I started today to record what was going to be the next niche gold making video, very delayed, a part of the series, obviously. But every time I opened TSM, it, clash it crashed my client. And that kind of got me more interested in making the other video I was planning to make, which is kind of a where I'm at with gold making right now in Battle for Azeroth and in general, and kind of where I've been as well. And since I can't record that P video until TSM gets fixed, which is going to happen in God knows when, um, why not go ahead and move on to that next video? So that's what this one's going to be, is a bit of commentary on what's going on with me right now as far as gold making and WoW is concerned, and possibly a little bit about what's going on with me IRL at the end there for those who have been following along and are curious. But let's go ahead and get right into it. Anyone who's followed me for a long time knows that the major way that I make gold is by crafting with all of the different crafting professions and selling. So I buy cheap materials on the auction house, using, usually using TSM shopping to, you know, buy up all, all this cheap materials. I craft it into whatever people might need, usually current content. I don't really deal in transmog or old stuff all that much. And then I sell it. So TSM was a very important part of my... Uh, of my regimen. I needed TSM. I have become very add-on dependent, I've realized recently. I particularly need TSM to sync across my two accounts. Now, back in the day when TSM was new, I had to do this manually every time I logged in. I had to copy my save variables folder from one account's folder in Windows to the other in order to update who had what items, but it worked. Like, that's how you did it back then. I had to make a little, little videos to show people how to do it, but that was how you could do it. Then they introduced account syncing automatically within the add-on. It was amazing. It was the, a dream come true. I loved it. And so recently, of course, TSM 4 has come out. And really quick, before I get into anything else I'm going to say, I want to say this because this is the most important thing I'm going to say in all of this video regarding Trade Skill Master. No one on that team needs to devote so much time to us. They choose to. By, I say to us because we benefit from it. I'm sure they're doing it because they enjoy it and things like that. I hope they enjoy it. But basically what I'm saying is I do recognize that they are doing something that benefits me. And while, yes, I do pay for premium, um, I technically, you know, I don't give them enough for what I get. It's like they have... They go above and beyond to really produce a really robust add-on, and I don't want anyone to think that I don't appreciate that. And I want to say that first because I'm about to probably go off a little bit because I am irritated beyond all belief. Trade Skill Master 4 was not ready for release. There, I'll say it. I've seen a lot of other people say it. I know I'm not the only one who thinks it, but it's true. Trade Skill Master 4 should not have been pushed out. It is less stable than Trade Skill Master 3 by a long shot. There are massive features that are not working. There are features that existed in TSM 3 that do not exist in TSM 4. And they are ones that I explicitly talked about in the beta that I was in and said, hey, we used to be able to do this. I would like to be able to do it. That was important to me. And devs would say, okay, we'll look into adding that. And it's still not in there. There's such simple things like being able to shift click an item and have it auto populate in the search. When I attach items to mail, it allows me to attach the same item three times and it will consider the mail filled up even though I haven't actually filled it up because for some reason it's allowing me to attach multiple, an item multiple times. Today when I was trying to record the next niche gold making video, I, if I was in a group and I clicked to another group, it would crash my client. Premium users have no way to roll back to trade skill master three. I can no longer shift click an item to add it to a group from the auction house pane. I have to actually add in the items from my bags or import a shopping list. You know what? I would be 110% okay with all of these. They would irritate me, but I would be like, okay, it's evolving. It will change. But here is the thing. Account syncing has been broken since day one. The first thing I did was go on Discord and say, hey, account syncing's not working. The devs basically said, oh, that's weird, and shrugged and basically didn't acknowledge that it was a problem. Um, a few days later, I guess some other people had also reported the same problem, and it appeared on their known issues list. So I said, okay, thank God. People know it's an issue. It will get fixed. It allegedly got fixed. It was removed from the known issues thing. When I went to the Discord and said, hey, it's not working, they said, no, it's been fixed. Do all these things. I did all of the, all of the troubleshooting problems. It's still not fixed. And no one's talking to me about it. 
and I can't even roll back to trade skill master three, which was at least functioning for me. And so I virtually can't really make gold. Don't get me wrong, I've made like a million since the expansion came out, but I should have been able to make four to five million easily with the professions that I have and like the, the plan that I had, but it was just non-functioning. I can't use my other account um, and I can't like, I'm not gonna, especially in the beginning of an expansion. I mean, my, my item level is 340 today. I've done, I mean, I'm, I've cleared every mythic. I've got the freehold mythic amount on my first drop. Pretty excited. My guild, where I'm on a backwater server that hasn't done a lot of raiding, so we went and uh, got the server first mythic Argus kill. Um, so it's like, I'm I'm busy. I can't be logging out, just out, logging onto a bank alt who I had to set up. I set up a new bank alt on my main account specifically to be a placeholder so that I could at least sell some <laughs> auctions until Trade Skill Master's been fixed. And it's like, I thought, oh, this will be a, I even have my, it's profile called temporary workaround and it's not functioning because like, I can't log, I, I, I do not want to log on a fade every 10 minutes to see if something's sold. Cause of course, as you guys know, that's how fast things move in the first week of the expansion. I needed that second account to be functioning so that I could easily send stuff over every time it's sold. And I can't because it doesn't see what I can craft, doesn't see how much things cost to craft, it doesn't see what I have in my inventory. It is non-functioning and it has been since day one. And this is a big deal. I know it's not a big deal to everyone because not everyone runs two accounts, but if anything, that gives me more anxiety that it's not going to be fixed because it's not something that's going to affect the large portion of the Trade Skill Master audience. So yeah, that said, you can probably hear that I am a little bit perturbed in regard to gold making and also now gold making videos because I can't even do that without Trade Skill Master crashing my client. So I am pretty upset regarding Trade Skill Master. I have to reiterate now that I appreciate the individuals who work on it. I don't mean to put them on blast because they're spending their time making an add-on for a game, and that's amazing, and I appreciate that they're putting that effort into such a robust thing for us all to use, but I do wish they would at least make it so that it could roll back to a stable and functioning... I mean, hell, I don't even care if it's not stable. I would deal with a few errors here and there on Trade Skill Master 3. That's the other thing. In the Discord, every time someone comes in and asks to roll back, and someone does very frequently because a lot of issues are in Trade Skill Master 4, people are just told, no, you can't roll back. There's no support for Trade Skill Master 3. It's like, well, at this point, there's really not a whole lot of support for Trade Skill Master 4 issues either, is there? No, not really. So please just let us roll back to Trade Skill Master 3 until you've fixed 4. Okay, so rant over. Oh, look, a TSM error window has popped up on my other screen while I've been saying this. I wasn't even clicking on anything. Wonderful. So what I've been doing, just to get more into general gold making, is I did level fades blacksmithing, which has been my main source of gold. Have you guys noticed that blacksmithing PvP gear doesn't take expulsum, but all the other professions do, except for inscription as well, I think? So blacksmithing is a really nice contender for making uh, for making item level 300 gear because you don't need expulsum and you can get the rank patterns just using marks of honor So I've been I've made about a million gold not all through blacksmithing, but mostly um, Though I've spent most of that I actually I downed only about three million gold liquid because I decided to buy a lot of BOEs not to flip just to use so I'm a little bit in the hole and which normally wouldn't bother me but since God only knows how long it's gonna take me to make it back since I'm not going to manually recraft everything uh, at, like that I normally sell because it would just take way too much time but until TSM is fixed I can't really use much other than I mean I just have to manually check each time I sell something each time I log in okay what's sold what's what do I need to recraft okay now I have to manually post it it's uh it's a pain in the ass so my gold making is kind of in a in a, it's stuck in the mud right now until this gets fixed um so that's where I'm at so let's move on from there onto more positive things. The expansion as a whole. It's been great so far, honestly. I some a lot of the quests seem very fillery, but the quest but the uh the story's interesting. The quests are interesting if a little bit fillery. Um I've finished all of the Jaina quest line, I've finished all of the war campaign up until here. i I was on vacation until next Wednesday until, for another day and a half now. So that's why I went so hard into it. I was like, I'm going to get everything done while I still have time. 
So uh, I've done a lot of this stuff and I enjoyed pretty much all of it. I'm even enjoying World Quest right now, though I'm sure that I'll get a little bit bored of them soon, but as long as I'm getting rep, I see the value in doing them. I've found I have a surprising love for island expeditions, so I'm probably going to keep doing those. I've done a lot more even though I've already finished my weekly, just because they're something fun, they're, they're fast-paced, they're challenging without being frustrating. I'm also having to do a lot of PvP because I didn't save, a bunch, a bu save up a bunch of Marks of Honor to get rank patterns, so I'm PvPing on my 110 Arms Warrior on Horde, so that's been a lot of fun as well. Now, where I've been in real life and moving forward. My, I'm in grad school now. For those who didn't really follow that whole story situation, I skipped a Warlords of Draenor. In the middle of Legion, I got into a graduate program. I moved across the country, so I now live on the opposite side of the United States. I am one year into a two and a half year program. The new semester starts on Wednesday. I want to get, I mean, because I've been so, there's so much new stuff to talk about in Battle for Azeroth, and there, you know, I, I, I'm feeling that gold making bug again. I really want to make videos again, so if Trade Skill Master gets fixed soon, which god I hope it does, I want to get back into videos. Probably not streaming, just because, unless it's like, it, it'll be at random times. So I don't want to do the scheduled stream thing anymore, because I don't want to feel like, oh, I don't have anything I really want to do, but I have to because I have to go stream. Um, but I do want to get back into making gold videos if Trade Skill Master gets fixed. So hopefully you'll be seeing more from me, particularly gold making related content. Uh, we will see though. I hope you guys are having a lot of fun with the new expansion and hopefully you'll be hearing from me again soon.